first graders welcome back to learning with m if you are new to this channel then my name is manika and i'm a former mathematics educator this is a part of my series maths with grade 1 today i'm going to teach you tens and ones if you like to learn from these videos then please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell just below this video so are you ready to learn with them then let's get started let's learn tens and ones jim helped his uncle on the farm His uncle had many apple trees on his farm. Jim helped him in collecting the apples and packing them in baskets. He packed 10 apples in each basket. Let's help Jim in counting the apples. One, two, three, four apples. Why don't you say with me? Five, six. Seven. Come on, say along with me. Eight. Nine apples. And ten. He packs ten apples in a basket. We can call the loose apples once. and the set of 10 apples tens ten ones together make one ten this is also called bundling of ones into groups of tens it makes counting easier let's try to count these apples by bundling them into groups of tens there are two tens and three ones Two tens and three ones make twenty-three apples. Let's try one more example. How many apples are there in all? Five tens: one, two, three, four, and five. and four ones one two three and four so there are 54 apples it's time for fun facts with them did you know the prefix deca means 10 such the word decade means 10 years decagon means a 10 sided shape d 
Decathlon means 10 athletic events. Every two digit number has tens and ones. The number 65 has six tens and five ones. And the number 82 has eight tens and two ones. The number 39 has three tens and nine ones. It's time for practice now. Count the tens and ones. There are one ten and one one. One ten plus one one makes ten plus eleven, which is eleven sticks. Let's try one more. Count the tens and ones. There are two tens, one and two, and seven ones, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Two ten and seven ones mean twenty plus seven, which is twenty seven. Good job! You are doing great! If you liked this video, then please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends so that they can also learn with them. And please subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any new video. I'm going to meet you in the next video with a great lesson. Till then, bye-bye!